parameters. Back to work when the sun goes down. Brooklyn JMZ into the city. Transfer at Washington Square, down to the Triangle. Rising from below like the living dead, into the sun, the light shocking my eyes. Walking those ten minutes between the subway and the bar always felt so good. But that feeling never lasted. Some days the city's a vampire. It steals all your best moments. They come and go in seconds and fade away. You end up remembering only the worst. bar at bad weather. I just walked in and they handed me a shaker. Took me on for my ravishing looks. I think the owner had a little crush. My winning smile. Hey, what's that drink you invented? I laughed at my past. Laughed at my family. Joked about everything. Even the end of the world. And last time? Shirley Templar? Shirley Templar? What's in it? The usual. I just had some gin. Night on! Portos! There was a big dream floating out there, and every night I saw people dreaming it. I don't know how they did it. It takes as much money to smile as to pay rent in this place. my family, the more I hated myself for it. I told myself I wanted a new family. I wanted to start over. Lights, action, bass drum, mind-numbing, 124 beats per, twice the speed of a beating heart.
are you from? He was raised in a cult or something like that. You know, out west. My parents were conspiracy freaks. They live off the grid. In the woods. Seriously? God, they all look so good. The girls in their skirts. Batting eyes. Beads of sweat. Everyone was so beautiful in those flashing lights.
I've been smoking those funny pipes.
Mentor? Now should be a time for remembrance and mourning, I know. But our enemies do not permit us that luxury. Yusuf thought highly of you, assassin. And I find no reason to second-guess this judgment. Do you have it in your heart to lead these men and women, and to maintain the dignity of our order, as Yusuf did with such passion? It would be an honor. Bene, I am glad. Our enemy is close. Take positions around the tower, and wait for my command. Where is she? I admire you, Ezio. But your bloodlust makes it hard to call you a friend. Bloodlust? A strange insult from the man who ordered an attack on his own nephew. He was to be kidnapped, Ezio. Not killed. I see. Kidnapped by the Byzantines, so that his uncle could rescue him and be heralded a hero. More or less. Now, the keys. First, the girl. <laughs> She's all yours. Sophia! Tell your men to back off. She's all yours.
Are you hurt? Not, not hurt, but very confused. I did not mean to drag you into this. I am sorry. <laughs> you are not responsible for the actions of other men. All this will be over soon, but I need to recover what they have taken. I do not understand what is happening. Ezio, who are these men? Run!
been a thorn in my side. Ah! Go ahead, you I'm fine. What now, Ezio? How does this end? I am wondering that myself. Oh! Soldiers! Selim is not your master! You serve the Sultan! You carry out his command alone! Where is he? Where is the Sultan? He stands before you, brother. Father made his choice. <coughs> Selim! Stop! Please! <coughs> so, you are the assassin. Ezio Auditore. I am Selim, Suleiman's father. He speaks quite highly of you. He is a remarkable boy with a magnificent mind. Were it not for his endorsement, I would have you killed where you stand. Leave this place. Do not return. <laughs> you did the right thing, Ezio. This is not your fight. But where does one end and the next begin? Customs officer waiting to talk to everyone. I hope you have something for us. Absolutely. Passports and papers for everyone. Ah, brilliant. So I'm... I'm what? A new resurgent now, am I? You're a medical team from SUNY Upstate. Just back from Rome with your patient. Experimental gene therapy. Good work. Let's get this over with. Wait, look! This is crazy! What's wrong? I'm not sure, but Desmond's brain is lighting up like a string of firecrackers. Here it comes. What is that? What's going on? This is the end, Desmond. Scheduled for deletion. What are you doing? What is a man but the sum of his memories? We are the stories we live. The tales we tell ourselves. Don't do this. I'm saving you, idiot. Go! Go!
I write these lines with a steady hand and a light heart. We are in Acre now, Sophia and I, with the five Masyaf keys in our possession, and all the time in the world. Sophia is a seasoned traveler and a fine companion to have so far from home. Tomorrow we will make our way to Masyaf, and once there, into Altair's library, to fulfill our father's forgotten dream. Forgive the shortness of this letter, dear sister, for it is late, and we are tired. Perhaps, with luck, the next words you hear from me will be in person. Con affetto, Ezio. Such a climb. 